Today we're going to be diving into an interesting topic that concerns many of us young men. So in this video we're going to talk about why being overly nice can be detrimental to you. Believe it or not, one of the most dangerous words in the English language is nice. Because nice doesn't actually mean anything. People say be nice, she was nice, or that thing is nice. The thing with the word nice is it leaves a lot of room for interpretation. It's nice is something we actually do regardless of who or how we feel on the inside. So for example, if my children have a fight with each other and one of them argues and throws things, we always say, be nice to your sister. What I'm saying is, what I'm basically saying to them is, I know you're frustrated and I know you want to have a fight with her, but just pretend in a particular fashion that is so that it pleases me that you won't hurt your sister if you kind of get what I'm saying. It has nothing to do with the character of the person. It has nothing to do with transforming that person from the inside to be a better person. You're just forcing them to be something they're not. Being nice all the time is actually a battle against yourself because something may come up and you want to be a certain way. You want to be angry or you want to say something but really, in uh, any particular situation, you're going to have to, if you want to be nice, you're going to have to stuff it back down and not say a word. And how many times have you seen that happen, maybe at school or at workplace, where someone who really frustrates you, someone's in the wrong, or a family member said something to you, you want to say something back, but you're not allowed because you have to be nice all the time. But the thing is, there's a difference between being nice and being kind. What's the difference? Let's clarify it. Being nice and being kind. Kindness is a virtue and it's crucial to be considerate and compassionate to others. But on the other hand, being nice, too nice, often involves people pleasing. It involves avoiding conflict at any cost and neglecting your own needs. And that's not what being your most masculine means. You can't be at your most masculine and best version of yourself if you're too scared to voice your own opinions. When you're being kind to someone, there's a level of education you need, compassion, maturity you need. But when you're being nice, you don't need any of that. You force yourself to be something you're not. Whereas with kindness, you force yourself from the inside to be kind to that person. It's more authentic. It's because it's what you want to do. So being too nice might lead to suppressing your true self and putting on a facade to be liked by everyone else. You've got to learn to embrace who you are, including your strengths and your weaknesses. And people will respect you more when they see the real you. Even if that is your flaws and everything else. Being nice is what makes you tear someone apart. When you're being so nice, you're swallowing all the, all the crap that people give you. You nod your head and swallow it all up. But what happens in the end? It all gets built up over and over and it keeps piling up and no matter how nice you are everything has its limits and so do you so when you're over the limit and you've reached that point where you can't take any more you'll just throw up you'll throw up all that rubbish you've swallowed and you'll blow and that's when it will get ugly because you've you haven't said anything for so long and now you're just going to explode whereas you could have just not took any rubbish in the first place answer back to ha answer answer people back how they deserve i'm not saying be disrespectful and go swing at every person but you can say things in, in certain ways and that way you become a lot more respected as well let me know guys what you think you know is being nice good is being nice bad we're all we're all on this journey together we're all improving together so drop a comment down below and let's see what you think thanks for watching guys like the video and I'll see you in the next one.